Hi everybody, this is Mark with StarTech Video Tutorials. In this video today, I'm sharing uh, my desktop and I'm going to share some critical information you need to understand to protect yourself online from hackers infiltrating your computer and stealing information from you without your permission. Now, this is going on every day and we need to be protecting ourselves in different layers. Don't just never depend on just a single antivirus program to stop malware or clean it off your local computer. Okay, so real quick here, I'm showing you the privacy uh, tracks that was removed. I just ran this about, uh, let's see, about three days ago. I got 6,230 uh, tracks. Now you should be using Glary Utilities. I'll show, uh, I have a complete video course, detailed 12 module uh, tutorial available at uh, StarTech Video Tutorial Library. I'll share that at the end of the, this particular video. But this is something you need to understand how it happens. And it's real quick, Not it's not as complicated as it looks. Let's just put it that way. Okay, what happens is when your browser is open, information gets injected through your browser if you don't have a tool uh, like I use which is the malware uh, anti-exploit this is free it's running right now uh, in the background that'll help block it but I, by the way the reason it didn't block all these is because I had it off uh, doing some testing with some software so I just want you to be aware of that so what happens there's two places uh, in a computer nobody should have access besides yourself which is the administrator of the local computer this particular directory is called this is in Windows by the way uh, application data you'll see it right here now this came through my browser and it goes through your local temp folder that's accessed and this particular uh, file is an ex executable file now there's a lot of different stuff here. I don't want to go into detail or confuse anybody. But these temp folders under application data is being accessed via somebody outside of your computer that can actually run malware now because they can place these executable files on your local computer and it'll actually execute at a later date then you're infected. That's how you, they extract information from your computer like your banking, <laughs> logging information, anything like that. Okay, This is critical to understand uh, how they do it. Now the second thing is nobody else besides yourself, the admin on your computer, uh, should have access to your, your Windows directories or your local machine. That's another way uh, and this is coming from an external source internally yes Windows uses it but when it's coming from an external source you gotta be careful now I have a lot of other examples this is just Firefox here and um, I don't want to explain in great detail but again Firefox uh, they're actually in my application data file as well so I had a bunch of cache files but these are I got rid of those so just wanted to show you this and I'm gonna close this window and show you this is the results of the scan I just performed and you can see uh, all the different areas it was the tracks are caught right here and of course they were erased and which is not only located I got to view the report like you can and uh, this is all a great free tool so I just wanted to share that with you today now if you want to take the full 12 module course which is free of charge uh, and learn how to configure uh, the actual interface itself because uh, you really there's a lot here and it's a fantastic piece of software so if you want to know about that just go to startechvideotutoriallibrary.com and then head over to the video tutorial section local maintenance and then glary utilities okay it's a rather long URL so here's the page and then when you want to start you just uh, click on it now th this is non-member access meaning you don't have to be a member although being a member uh, doesn't cost you anything so you can find more information about that on our front page okay so you'd click on this link and it would probably open uh, in a window like this or a different window looks like that particular video needs some work uh, click that one here we go and we'll take a look at uh, 
the covers, but the videos play quite well. So you're going to see quite a bit of information here. So that's all i got for today. Mark with StarTech Video Tutorial.